part of what we're talking about here is that some of these things are vaccine preventable. So how do you how do you bring those conversations together? They prevent the acute disease or hospitalization or whatever the metric is, but they also are preventing these long-term syndromes yeah. from HPV vaccines preventing cancer. We're seeing the chickenpox vaccine being shown to prevent dementia later in life. And so I think we don't fully appreciate the long-term consequences of any of these viruses. If they don't have a high mortality rate in the acute phase, we kind of shrug them off. Like, yeah. all right, you're going to yeah, get right. that and <laughs> you'll move on to the next. But yeah. You think about like noroviruses, which we all get, and it's the worst. And we kind of treat them like they're no big deal. But in a lot of people, that's kind of the onset virus trigger before dysautonomia, postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome. And so it becomes an interesting question of people are predisposed. They have no idea. They're not, you know, I think, walking around knowing that yeah. this acute infection could change their life forever. 